Good morning. It has been quite a while since we last vlogged um, and our lives have changed, but uh, I will explain more about that later on. Um, I'm now making breakfast. Um, I am making pancakes and I made an American style pancake batter, I guess, um, with mashed banana, chia seeds, water, um, apple cider vinegar, baking soda and two types of flour. Um, yeah, I think they look great. I also added some broken pecans, so um, I think they, they will be a good, good and delicious breakfast. I thought I would just start blogging uh, about our life, so not just about what we are doing, not just about our uh, zero waste journey that some of you know about, not just about the dogs but everything together. Um, so yeah, it starts with breakfast on a Saturday morning. They're not for you guys, girls. No, the dogs are having a very different breakfast. And once I've taken the dogs outside, uh, you will see what they're eating as well, of course. And the last pancake is done, so it's time for breakfast. And we are eating these pancakes with some Avoca raspberry jam that Yodi's parents brought us. And I've got a, hi Venus, a cup of Paka tea, which isn't a tea, it's... I don't know, it's a mixture of blackcurrant something and licorice. Hi Mojo. I am outside with Venus at the moment. Um, there are lots of dogs here in the park and Mojo doesn't really care for them, but Venus loves it. Um, so we'll, uh, we might go into the dog park as well, depending on the dogs that are there. Um, but at least she can interact with some dogs not with others um, and some people not with others and I think that's a good way to socialize not let, letting them play with everything that's around um, but anyways that's the plan for this morning come is my share kijk eens hey we zitten kijk eens sit goed zo oh yeah Goed zo. Dat is braaf. Goed zo. En is omhoog. Tja. Goed zo. Kom. Yes. Yes. Kom maar. Venus. Omhoog. Tja, tja, tja. Ja. Goed zo. So we are currently in Dublin, Ireland. Um, as some of you may know, we uh, transformed a van into a camper and we traveled uh, through Sweden for two months and we've been in Germany and Denmark. Um, but whilst looking for seasonal work, we really couldn't find anything. And we had just assumed that it would turn out all right, but it didn't and I guess sometimes in life you have to have some form of hope and we had a bit too much maybe so instead we started looking for jobs all around Europe because at that time we obviously didn't have a fixed home and well aside from our camper van but that could be parked anywhere so eventually we found a job here in Dublin both in the same office same team and um, yeah, so we moved here, but living in a camper van in such a city is not possible. It's not camper van friendly at all. Um, and also for the dogs, it wouldn't be nice to be in a camper van. Um, so we moved into an apartment. So a lot of money is going to rent, but um, we actually enjoy it here. Um, and it will just be a thing, a place for us temporarily. Um, but uh, yeah, so you know where we are, Dublin, Ireland. And we are just, well, we're still in the city. It's quite, quite central-ish, but it's, um, it's very, a very quiet area. And um, as you see, I'm now in a massive park. And there's also a market here every Saturday, which I'm going to next with Mojo. Um, 
and yeah it really is a quiet calm lovely area so we looked out on that one but obviously living is very expensive that won't change um, but yeah you'll see bits and bits as we go along of where we live I'm going back now. It's still raining, um, but it's time to go to the market, which was just close by the dog park. And um, I know that Mojo really doesn't like rain, but she'll, she'll have to deal with it. <laughs> um, and um, Mojo is going to carry a backpack and bring some of the jars that will be filled with dry produce and bring them back home because uh, one week ago now he already dislocated his knee standing still and walking isn't really something he can do well and comfortably at the moment so he's at home and um, it means that I can't take as many bags as usually so um, yeah, Mojo's gonna carry some jars for me and we might have to take two trips um, to, to get everything that we need because we haven't been to this market in a while because we've worked on Saturdays um, but it's finally the time where we can go back there most Saturdays now and um, yeah, pick up everything we need So we just had two slices of that sourdough bread each um, with some peanut butter and it was delicious and I'm now outside with Mojo. Mojo and I are on our way to the market. So the market is up there and I just walked all the way here with Venus as well. It's quite close to home, I think 15 minutes or so. And there's a small stall that has dry produce, so we're going to pick some up. I'm not sure if I will film there, just a little maybe. Loving this backpack by the way. It's by Herta. I will link it below. Um, so on this side we have organic turmeric powder and oregano and I will use the turmeric to make uh, our golden paste. I will link the golden paste below as well. And on this side we have chia seeds and organic cocoa powder. So now the dogs have had their food and it's time to show you what we got at the market. So this was quite a big haul, usually we have like a half of this but because we worked on Saturdays a lot we couldn't 
go to the market since New Year's and it's nearly the end of January so yeah it was much needed. So this is a bottle of Sonnet dish soap and it was empty so we filled it up with Lily's Eco Clean which is made in Dublin and is biodegradable. Here we have bicarbonate of soda, bentonite clay and both of these we use to make our own toothpaste um, but we also use this a lot for cleaning as well and in baking. Then we have a replaceable head for our dish brush, penne pasta, um, then we have brown basmati rice, pui lentils which are a type of green brown lentil from France if I'm correct, um, this is couscous, then we have cayenne pepper, um, turmeric which I said I will be using to make some golden paste for the dogs, um, I will link the recipe below, it's a good joint supplement, it's also good for people actually during cold weather. Then here we have sesame seeds, it's quite a lot, um, but this is very high in calcium, so I want to include it in more salads and dinners and stuff because we do not eat dairy much at all. Um, here we have walnuts and um, dates, raw organic cocoa powder, um, which is in my opinion the best cocoa powder you can get um, in the Netherlands and also in, I think, little across Europe. You get a very dark type and it's not nice at all in my opinion, very bitter. This is delicious um, and yeah we use it in breakfast a lot. Chia seeds as well, we use it in breakfast every day so um, high in omega-3 and you can digest it very well because the cell wall is very thin so it's very healthy for you and yeah we use that daily and here we have oregano and we really like it in a lot of sauces so yep that's it. Jordi is making dinner tonight. We are having penne pasta that I just bought at the market with tomatoes, oregano, thyme, portobello mushrooms, cayenne pepper, smoked paprika, what else? Lemon and wild spinach. I just did the dishes and now it's time for dessert. We have one orange each, one blood orange each and half a kiwi. <laughs> 